back to the next video in today's video i will show you how to send a push notification to a web app or an android app or an ios app from your node.js server with firebase uh, cloud messaging so firstly what you will have to do is you will have to create a firebase project so i have created a simple firebase project once you create a firebase project what you will have to do next is you will have to click on this settings icon over here go to project settings go to service service accounts and i am using a node.js backend uh, that's why i will download a file which is uh, relevant to node.js but there are other uh, backend environments uh, supported as well like uh, java go and python so here you can see you will have to click on this firebase admin sdk click on node.js and here you will have to click on uh, generate new private key now once you click on this generate new private key it will download a file for you and that file you will have to drag and drop to your node.js backend now uh, let's create a node.js project so here as you can see uh, i have created a uh, just create a package.json file and inside that package.json file uh, you can just add uh, express and you also need to add firebase admin now if you and just do npm install uh, so here you can see i have dragged and dropped uh, that uh, file which i have downloaded from firebase to my project next go to index.js and here i have just simple stuff like i have imported express i have imported firebase admin then i have also imported the file which we have over here so make sure you change the file name to whatever your file name is next i have created express object of express as well as the port number and currently uh, to send a push notification to any kind of a client like a mobile app or a web app you need a token and currently uh, i have created an android app uh, and that android app sends uh, once the android app is uh, like uh, opened uh, it sends a token to our backend server i am storing it in, in an array but you can insert it in a real database as well just for simplicity sake i have taken an array over here now this is like normal express js stuff like i'm using url encoding uh, data is in json format here we are initializing our admin firebase app firebase admin sorry and this is for course handling so you can ignore it and this uh, pa this uh, uh, endpoint will help us to uh, send a push notification to uh, our uh, mobile device so here i'm first checking if there is any token or not uh, if there is no token then return an error message if there is any token then i am just sending the uh, message to the first token okay just for simplicity sake but uh, here you can add any token which you want to and the title and body you can replace it to however you like then you just have to call admin dot messaging dot send message and once the response is successful i am sending a success response if there is error then i am sending error response as well and this uh, if endpoint should be called from your mobile app or from your web app to submit the token so if you see over here i want a token in this post request and i am just appending to our token array that's it and this is another helpful me helper methods which i have created for expressjs you can ignore it if you want to and here i have started our server okay now i have already uh, started my mobile app uh, as well like uh, if you are curious on how to create it for android i will make an another video for it as well uh, so yeah stay tuned for that uh, so if you see over here i have my android app over here and there are no notification as such what i'll do is i have uh, started my node.js server i will go to localhost colon 3000 i will refresh it I'll quickly come back and here you can see I have got the notification with the title as well as with the body uh, now uh, please note that the app was opened still I was able to send the notification uh, so now I will close the app I'll open this okay I'll again hit localhost colon 3000 and here you can see the notification is still uh, uh, delivered so yeah uh, that's it uh, uh, stay tuned if you are uh, wanted to if you want a tutorial for android as well uh, thank you for watching bye